Hello everyone and welcome to this Laravel basics tutorial on routes. As you can see on the screen we have a view. But how is this view on our screen? Let's look into the code and see. Here we have just a simple HTML it's actually a PHP file but it's in HTML and this is the code for the screen we were just looking at, the view. But this isn't responsible for showing us that view. If we go over here to routes, this is what's responsible for showing us that view. Here we're calling the route class and the get method of that class. We're passing in the root view since this is just on the root so if you see L as a L4 dot dev that was the root of the project the application and then what we're doing is we're executing a callback function and that function is simply the return the class view with the method of make and then the view now it doesn't have to be a PHP or anything appended onto it all you have to have is simply the name of the view. Now let's say we have a new folder and we just say home and we were to create a new file and just have index. Let's just say we want to call it index.php and let me save it first. Okay. I'm just going to take on this index.php I'm just going to say let's just say Hello from Laravel 4. Now, since it's in this folder, we have to address it a little bit differently. So instead of saying just index, that's not really going to get us anything. Let's see what it does. If we will refresh, here it goes. It's going to throw an error. It's going to tell us that the view index is not found. It's because it's not in the it's not in the views folder itself and the way we get around that is we simple, simply append the name of the folder that it's in so if we go home dot index and then save it and go ahead and refresh and here we go so using home dot index is essentially the same thing as doing this home index what's happening behind the scene is that Laravel itself is replacing the dot with this. And there are, very, there are a lot of different methods to this class of route. There is route get, route post for posting information, route put for updating information and route destroy for deleting information and we'll get into those later this is just meant to be a basic explanation of what a route is when we move into classes you'll see a different form of route but for right now this is basically all you need to know from about a route is that this is simply the name of the class which is a route this is the method of that class this is the route that it's actually being sent to. So if I was to go to route get about and simply we'll return just uh, something static here. We'll just say return is about and save it and go back in here and just type in about 
and there you go. So this is being sent to the about route and this is what it's returning. It doesn't get any simpler than that. As we move through this series we'll learn more about routes. So stay tuned for the next, for the next tutorial which will be on views.